What up peeps and peepettes, Morbtron back to add more Destiny 2, and today we are doing a weapon review. I know it's been a while, but we're looking at the Agamid. It is from Dead Orbit. I'm sure many of you already have it, but how many of you have actually used the thing? It is a 110 RPM hand cannon in the kinetic slot. Like I said, you get it from Dead Orbit from the Faction Rally Switch. Hey, it's going on right now. So Dead Orbit is the last of the three factions that I had to pledge to. So that is why I'm reviewing the Agamid at this point in time and not forever ago. But anyway, we're going to take a look at it here. It's got a good choice of sights. It's got Steady Hand, Crossfire, and Hit Mark. Probably the three best hand cannon sights in the game. Now, I chose Hit Mark HCS as kind of a good middle ground between Steady Hand and Crossfire. If you really, really like range, go Crossfire. If you really, really like stability and handling, pick Steady Hand. Uh, personally, with a hand cannon, it's not that big of a deal to have increased stability and handling speed for me, so I went with Hit Mark because it's kind of a good middle ground, like I said. Now, in the magazine slot, we have Alloy Mag or Armor Piercing Rounds. Now, Armor Piercing Rounds does over-penetrate targets and causes extra damage to combatant shields. However, it does not cause extra damage to Guardian's shields in the Crucible. And it's, it's really not that great of a perk. And with the Hand Cannon, especially a 110, usually their reload speeds are pretty garbage. This one's not bad. It's got fairly decent reload speed. This just makes it faster when your magazine is empty. So I'm a fan of fast reload speeds. So sue me. Alloy magazine it is. And it has Rampage. So it kills the weapon temporarily. Grant increased damage, which kind of plays into Alloy Mag. That's kind of the downfall of Rampage. Is it tends to fall off once you reload. But hopefully with Alloy Mag, I'll be able to keep it up. Now... What I will say is the weapon is very good. I've actually already done my Crucible with it. Got a lot of good plays with it. It does a lot of damage if you can land shots to the Dome Ski. So that's kind of what you need to do with a 110. Since they do a lot of damage to the Dome Ski, you want to hit people right square in the middle of their face, which is a lot easier to do in... PvE land than it is PvP land. But oh, we weren't able to keep up the three stack of Rampage, but it, it, it does make it easier. It does make it a little bit easier. Alright, you know what? We're just gonna we're gonna end this guy's career real quick. There we go. Melting point, and now you get to taste my hammers along with the rest of your people, because honestly, what I can say about this hand cannon is that it's good. You need to give it a try if you haven't, and uh, we're going to step into the Crucible, and we'll see how I do. Alright, so we're floating down to Legion's Gulch. We're going to see how we do here. Matchmaking tonight has been kind of slow, so I'm not really expecting the matchmaking system to oh. be super fair, but we'll see what happens. Um... Gotten control every single time as well. So I haven't done much of the 6v6 quick play. Uh, most of the D2 that I've played has been doing the new uh, prestige raids and things of that nature. That is... where is that? That's friendly. Okay. They have the lead. All right, we have somebody going to get power ammo. That's good. I just missed out on getting a kill there. That was bad. Well, let's go with Friendo over to A and see what we can't do with this hand cannon. It hurts to the dome ski. Oh, jeez. I think my grenade <laughs> bounced off of that rocket. I, I didn't. I wasn't paying attention to see what they had. I guess. Let's jump over our friend's head. And there's all of that amazing damage. 
This hand cannon hurts something fierce. Oh, where are you? Okay. I couldn't see you. But you should burn a fair amount anyway. There we go. Oh, let's get away from that. Oh, hi! Man, I am just not having good times running around corners tonight. Corners are like... I don't know. The anti-morb tonight. Can we, can we not? Let's just put that there. Just in case that fool decided to run back that way. He did not. That hurts. That hurts a lot. Friendo took him down, though. Well, there's someone over here. There's a lot of people over here. Never mind. A lot of people over here. Run away. Okay. Zone B captured. You have zone and he out finessed me because he's a nimbly bimbly hunter. There we go. Hip fire him to death. The Agamid is doing me good. It trucks people in the face. If I can actually manage to hit my shots, that would have been a good one. Oh, I'm dead. Graviton and that grenade got me good. If I could, if this guy could stop lagging, holy wow. That guy is lagging up a storm. All right, we need to go back over to A. Zone A lost. Goodbye. Oh, come on. Shoulder charge. You're supposed to be... Sh oh, okay. The colony people using just all sorts of meta scumbag stuff in here. Because it's quick play. You can't have fun in quick play. You gotta use scumbag stuff. And there's a rocket. Because why not? But we got, uh, we got the assist points there. Let's kind of stay and help capture this zone. We got an Enemaso coming up right there. Alright, so, back over to A. This hand cannon's doing some work. I must say, that uh, Crimson didn't really, I was peeking at the exact times he was shooting me in the face. Let's get over to that tether. Got him in the head, but got vigilance winged. It was kind of dumb of me to do that, but, you know, I got the kill. I was thirsty for a kill, and I got it. Paid the price. Enemy hammers. Enemy arc staff. Let's pull out the energy weapon.
Got him. Got him too. That's a three, a three feed there. Some good stuff. Come on, me. Hit my shots. Oh, let's not die, though. Ah! Oh. Well, the recovery from shoulder charge needs to be faster. Three minutes. Seventy-one to the dome ski. Hard to beat that. Can I get some Telesto, friend? I'd love to get some Telesto. Thank you. Make them cry. Aw. Wasted Telesto. Sorry, I still got four shots left. Don't kill me. Don't kill me when I got Telesto. Ah. I don't know how they managed to run through my Telesto bolts without dying. But it was not appreciated. Also, that grenade is not appreciated. I am beyond dead here. Not sure how I'm alive. There we go. We're going to lose this, but I've had some good plays here. I'm not really sure. I think the teammates just aren't pulling their weight. I also haven't really captured many zones, so I might be a little bit to blame, but I've had fun. I'm not really a f Like, I get enough of control for Iron Banner, and, like, standing in place and just watching a bar fill up is only so much fun. I want to shoot people in the head. Nope. Just gonna nope right out of there. Teammates, if you're smart, you would also nope right out of there, but you're probably not going to. How is he not... Okay, that was a super laggy titan. That's fine. That's fine. You know, he just full healed after I punched him in the face. Not once. But twice. 21 eliminations. Not bad. 1.75 KD. We did good. The enemy team just did better. That guy, Mega Magikarp. 30 elims, 4.9 efficiency. With 5 captures. 6 captures for another guy on their team. Yeah, we were just... We are just behind... Just behind altogether. But that doesn't mean that this hand cannon didn't do some serious work. I would actually masterwork this thing if I had the cores for it. It's probably my favorite 110, I gotta say. Probably my favorite 110. Just because it's got Rampage and the Alloy Mag makes it at least a little bit better on the reload speed. Um, yeah, you know what? I'm just gonna... We'll do this for now. We'll do that for now. You earned it, Agamid. You earned it. But that is going to be it for this weapon review. So is the weapon good? Yeah. Yeah, it's good. It's good stuff. It's great stuff. Definitely pick one up if you haven't. But if you like this video, you want to see more of these weapon reviews, hit that like button for me. Likes are greatly appreciated, so thank you very much in advance for hitting that like button. If you're new to my channel, you want to see more of my daily content, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for me. Again, greatly appreciated. Thank you very much. So, so close to 3,000 subs. I can almost taste it. Almost taste it. Tastes kind of like, uh, like pennies. Kind of weird taste. But yeah, anyways, don't forget to have a good day, everybody, and I'll catch you all next time.